Hey guys, it's uh, Lewis here again. Uh, I'm going to start this video off with uh, a big thank you to everyone who has been watching uh, my videos, my YouTube. Uh, I know it's been quite quiet, quiet recently, but we're going to try and build it back up this year. Um, I'd also like to say thank you to everyone who watched the previous Lightlock videos. Uh, from them, I managed to secure myself a full-time job at the company, helping out with sales and marketing. So, big thank you to everyone who has viewed, commented, shared the videos. It's clearly helped me get to where I am now, so thank you very much. Um, today's video is to show you this. So this is the world's first insurance rated flexible D-lock. Obviously again made by Lightlock, uh, made in Wales, made in Britain company. Um, and yeah, I thought I'd share it with you. Um, it's pretty unique as you can see, flexible, and um, it does what a regular D-lock can't do. So I'll start with the locking mechanism. This is high intensity um, aerospace grade material which uh, makes it virtually unbreakable to uh, most common theft tools. So the Boa Flexico uh, is made out of uh, various high grade materials. Um, these include uh, high intensile steel, complex polymer composites and aerospace grade alloy which gives it that flexibility but also um, as tough to be um, given the accredited soul secure ratings which it has. When it comes to um, theft then and talking about how this can withstand common theft tools um, with a bolt cropper you can see from the videos on light lock testing as well what it'll want to do is just flex and inside the bubble flex core it'll be doing exactly the same thing so it won't give you a clean cut like uh, many other d locks and bicycle locks will um, it'll actually withstand the force and just want to keep springing back the most common theft uh, is done by a torsion so twisting of the lock or actually using the bike to twist the lock as well. Um, many do put a pole through, like I said, and go like this. Um, I'll link the video uh, which we did at Light Lock as well, uh, which um, shows a regular silver D lock compared to our silver Flex U. Um, I was there when we made that video, um, and it's very interesting to see the difference. Um, I didn't really believe um, how good or capable this product was until I actually went and watched it and videoed it myself. Um, so yeah, it's very unique and um, it was quite scary when this uh, decided to break because uh, it made a loud bang and uh, could have done some damage to someone if we weren't uh, safe. But like we did take the right steps to be careful and uh, yeah, it was a good day. I enjoyed myself a lot and uh, learnt a lot of new things. But yeah, um, this can withstand uh, any sort of uh, common theft tool attack uh, for the silver rating. If you are in more of a high risk area or somewhere where you know um, bike theft or theft in general is high, um, a gold is probably the best one to get. So when it comes to the Flex U, there's two sizes available. We have the regular, which is on my bike at the moment, and the large, which is in my hand. So the regular is perfect for your day-to-day um, -day things. Uh, pop into the shop where you know there's going to be a bike stand or somewhere where you know uh, there's a small railing or anything like that to lock your bike to. The large is the one which I would recommend and the ones I use the most uh, and that's purely because of the size um, and the size leads to more various uh, locking options. Um, this includes uh, lamp posts and things like that. So with a D-lock, because normally the end comes off, it's very hard to get uh, around a lamp post. Because of the flexibility, you're actually able to sort of circulate around the lamp post, lock it and it'll keep that sort of shape. So it's a lot and a lot easier than uh, a regular D-lock. Uh, it's perfect for in an area which you may not know, so if you're on holidays, um, or you know where there may not be a bike stand available. So the next best option is uh, a lamppost or a fence which is ground anchored to the floor. Um, yeah, I think that's um, really unique and that's the main thing about this lock. Um, it does what a D-lock cannot do and still be light. So when it comes to both of the locks, as you can see, they've got a male and female end. And what you can do is, uh, if your mate has one, or you have uh, two of the silver, what you can do is open them up and lock them together to make uh, a bigger area for you to lock around. So if I lock that together, as you can see, it just gives you a lot more space to be creative, um, if you're locking a couple of bikes together 
or um, you need something a little bit longer to maybe lock another bike to uh, and your wheel and then maybe something like a ground anchor in the middle or anything like that or if you're a little bit further away from something which you want to lock to so um, again a lot more locking options with these um, with a D-lock you actually can't lock them together because they go into the same fitting so um, again we can do this on the gold and the motorbike as well because they have male and female ends so uh, pretty unique to light lock and uh, yeah let me know what you think that looks like in the comments we sell these as individuals twins and combos so the indiv individual is obviously the regular and the large on their own there you can see, uh, you can see the difference there then we have the uh, large twin so it's key to like twins so um, four keys uh, two locks key to like same as the regular we have the four keys and the uh, two locks key to like but my favorite is the combo so this is this isn't key to like um, but I love the way that it fits inside each other So as you can see they can fit inside each other there so you've got the rear wheel frame and a ground anchor and then front wheel to the front of the bike stand or front wheel to the wheel as well so different options so i'm just going to show you how to put the combo on the bike um, obviously you can do them individually as well but as you can see the combo is probably the perfect um head yet if you are thinking of a twin or a combo set So that's the combo on the top of the frame there. So um, really nice, fits inside each other really well and it will stay quite strong. If you don't have the room um, on the top tube, um, my road bike doesn't have the frame um, size for the large, um, but the regular could go in there if I wanted to on the, on the, on the downwards um, seat stay as well, which is pretty unique. Um, and they're the two different options if you want to uh, carry it on your bike. Um, sometimes I don't like to put it on my bike. Um, maybe I've got two water bottles or um, my frame isn't big enough because I've got a couple of bikes. Um, this is the bag I'm using for work at the moment. And what I will do is put it through like this. And I find this works really well because you can't feel the weight on the back of your bag. And that's what I'm doing at the moment, just carrying it like that. Um, sometimes I'll feed the strap through here to give it a little bit more um, sort of strength so it doesn't slide around a bit. But I find that works really well as well if you want to keep the space in your bag. Um, like I said, these are 40 to 50% lighter than any other silver lock on the market at the moment. Yeah, so it keeps the, keeps the weight down. So if you do want to buy a FlexiU or any light lock for that matter, head over to lightlock.com and you can check out the full range of gold, silver and the moto um, and don't be afraid to use my discount code. So the discount code is LB10 and what that will do will give you 10 percent off your order and that only includes light locks so no accessories and no theft protection. Um, but use it as many times as you want, give it to your friends, uh, make the most of it, you know, buy yourself a good light lock. Um, for the area which you're in so if you're in a high uh, risk area get a gold if you can be using it for family days out or on the back of your caravan or anything like that or with the kids you've got, you've got the silvers or if you've got a motorbike the light lock motor is there as well um, but yeah don't be afraid to use it give it to your friends um, enjoy the sunlight whilst we have it uh, wear a helmet as I always say and uh, yeah catch you guys soon